We're born again. We're saved. Sealed by the Holy Spirit. Okay. Who this? Who this, y'all? Who this? Who is this? Real rap. Who is this? Same little girl. What's the difference? It has been almost three years. If Gabby still looked like this, we should all be very concerned. Hebrews 5, 12 through 14, Paul puts this to us this way. He says, for though by this time you ought to be teachers, you need someone to teach you again the basic principles of the oracles of God. You need milk, not solid food. For everyone who lives on milk is unskilled in the word of God. Uh, I'm sorry, in the word of righteousness since he is a child. But solid food is for the mature, for those who have their powers of discernment trained by constant practice to distinguish good from evil. And then again, in 1 Corinthians 3, 1 through 3, Paul says, but I, brothers, cannot address you as spiritual people, but as people of the flesh, as infants in Christ, I fed you with milk, not solid food, for you are not ready for it. And even now you aren't ready, even now, for you are still of the flesh. For where there is jealousy and strife among you, are you not of the flesh and behaving only in a human way? He's talking to Christians, y'all. You guys, we have to grow. We have to mature. By this time next year, y'all, this same group, we shouldn't still be talking about nobody smell good. Like, we shouldn't still be talking about nobody's being born again. We come to God as we are, but we don't stay here. We don't stay as we are. 